Okay, I'll tell you what else. I'm going to extend the theory to our generation now so it's more applicable. <laughs> the musicians today who don't do drugs and in fact speak out against it, we're rock against drugs. Boy, they suck. <laughs> suck. Ballless, soulless, spiritless, corporate little bitches, suckers of Satan's cock, each and every one of them. <laughs> Sucking Satan's peckers. Suck it. Put that big scaly pecker down your gullet. We're rock against drugs, because that's what George Bush wants. <laughs> what we want, isn't it? Government approved rock and roll? Don't you want to be at a concert one night, look to your right and see Dan fucking Quail right next to you, man? You know you're partying, then you know you're on the edge. Fuck it, the Quail Monster's here. There ain't no coming back. We might be up till 11 tonight. Fuck this. We're rock stars who do Pepsi Cola commercials. Luckily, Satan's dick has many heads, so all these little demon piglets can nuzzle up and suckle all at once. And here comes a fella named Vanilla Ice. Here comes MC Hammer. Here's Madonna with two heads. Suck in Satan's pecker. Suck it. It's only your dignity, suck it. It's only your dignity, suck it. <laughs> MC Hammer, oh, for, I'm sorry, it's Hammer. He dropped the MC. I can't wait till he drops the hammer, too. How about this, drop it all. Good.
winning. People have powerful feelings.